I watched Lucy Malloy's Una Noche, which is was filmed in Cuba, set in Cuba. It's about Cubans. I don't believe Lucy Malloy is Cuban. Uh, it doesn't. I believe she's English, but studied in New York. Um, it doesn't say anything about her mother on her uh, biography, so maybe she's part Cuban. I'm not sure. Her father is definitely British. Um, this was. Uh, she was mentored by Spike Lee, and part of the funding for the film came from his grant that he gives out. And uh, this was her first feature after graduating from NYU. And it says that she like studied in, or you know visited Cuba a, a lot, researching the film. So um, I don't know. I feel a little trepidatious having a film about the like. Uh, perils and struggles of being a Cuban teenager being made by not a Cuban, but oh well. Um, all of the actors that were in it were non-actors, and apparently there was a big kerfuffle when it was going to open at, at Tribeca because um, a couple of the actors tried to like flee to basically live in America the way the teenagers in the film are trying to do, only not on a boat. Um, have to look into more of that see if they made it uh so what, what am I trying to say um okay so the film is about these three teenagers brother and sister who are twins and the brother's friend who works in the kitchen that he works in and the two of them are plotting to leave and the sister finds out and she um sort of messes with their plans a little bit and then you, it's a day in the life of all three of them so you can see how complicated everything is for all of them and why they would want to leave Cuba and and um, the shining beacon that is Miami for them, and why it's worth getting on this crazy boat raft thing to to light out for the territories, you know. Um, it's beautifully shot. It you know it makes the island look gorgeous. Um, the bright colors and the and the vibrant life um, and the wildlife and the streets and the performers and but it also shows like the poverty in contrast to the tourists um and I feel like it had maybe a couple too many ideas it was trying to work through about Cuba and none of them were very were developed enough to have a solid sort of commentary on any of them which was too bad but the um actors had amazing chemistry together they really felt like brother and sister and friends and a little more and um it just I thought it was kind of a great film if a, if you, you have to take a little bit with a grain of salt I guess um it's on Netflix you can watch it on Netflix it's from 2012 and uh I quite liked it despite the me sounding like I didn't like it with my criticisms but um it's just so beautifully shot and um, sort of a like simple but but um, understated kind of plot because it's more about the themes than the plot. Um, it made me really wish I could paint my apartment. My apartment's all white, and I always I just want to paint it like really bright colors. I just want like a giant pink wall and like a giant blue wall and like yellow wall, but not. My mom painted our house yellow when I was a kid, but like the like notepad yellow and that is not, or canary yellow or whatever, it's not a good yellow. I'm talking like banana peel bright yellow. That's a good wall yellow, not like pale yellow. Um, anyways, this was Una Noche, written and directed by Lucy Malloy. I don't think I'm saying her name right. It's M-U-L-L-O-Y? Malloy? I don't know. I don't know. Watch it on Netflix. Enjoy it. Enjoy your week.